Hello everyone, it's Ollie Eason here. This year I've been making a lot of one-off parts on the Shape Poco Pro. Usually a project would only take a day. That means within that day I would be getting the stock, finishing the design, making sure the measurements are correct, finishing the milling process, as well as performing any sort of manual finishing procedures that the project requires. That leaves very little time to film and make a video about what I'm making. Now, luckily, we have a few exceptions. This design, the three-post Mitchell plate, I've been making over and over again with very little alterations. And today, we're going to make one more in front of the camera. Taking a look at the design, it is quite simple. Circular features. Nothing crazy on the bottom, so I don't have to flip the part or make a circular soft draws. Now we are already in the cam menu. You can see that I've disabled the facing operation. The only surface finish I need, I would do it manually with a sanding pad. The first operation we do, it's with a eighth inch drill bit. We peck drill the full depth uh, as pilot holes for these three eighths clearance holes used for mounting the Mitchell plate. Then we bore out the clearance holes with a three flute quarter inch end mill. The next operation we also perform with a three flute quarter inch square end mill. And I keep it as a boring operation, which I found very useful for these counter sink features. The only difference uh, from the previous operation, it's now I'm selecting a stock to leave of 10 thou. And I clean up the rest of the feature with a quarter inch four flute ball end mill. The ball end mill allows us to interpolate these countersink features and leave a relatively smooth feature. Rest of the milling process it's quite simple. Mostly contour passes with the same three flute quarter inch end mill. The only difference is most of the contour passes will require a full width slot. And for those I just spam a lot of WD-40. Anyway, let's take a look at the milling process. <laughs> We'll be right back. 